it's an industry wide happiness after you won. I mean, <laughs> like I had Tamina Snook on the show. I remember like a couple days later, and I asked her about it, and she broke into tears talking about you accomplishing your dream. And it was just, it was really cool to see how supportive the rest of the locker room was when it came to you winning the title. Just how happy they were to see you accomplishing your dream. Yeah. I got I got a lot of a lot of texts, a lot of DMs from like you know um, wrestling community across the board, which made me feel really um, grateful and like proud and happy, and it it made me feel like a sentiment that I didn't necessarily um, know that I would feel. Um, this is like the top prize. This is the top prize in the company. Everyone everyone wants this. So the fact that everyone kind of took themselves out of that first second to just be happy for me because they thought I worked hard or they knew how much I love this. Um, it meant so much to me and it made the moment so much sweeter. It really, really did. I dude, I, you can always tell when somebody wins a, a title, like you winning that title or when Big E won the, the WWE title, you can always tell like how beloved they are amongst the locker room when all of a sudden there's just like an outpouring of social media. And like you said, everyone's there you know all the other women are there for that same goal they all want that title everyone wants to be the world champion you know and when they drop that for a second and they're just like man i'm just so happy to see someone else win i i love it it's one of my favorite things as a fan it gets me like goosebumps just thinking about it because it's just so nice to see a supportive community even when you're all aiming for the same prize yeah and also i just feel like it just felt like a change of tide to me at least like you know i, I feel like I, I read a stat that like i was the first woman to win the SmackDown Women's Championship that wasn't a course woman since like 2017. Crazy. And um, I I just feel like I hope that me being able to conquer that and to like, you know, achieve this, it gives all the other girls in the locker room that, you know, um, aren't a horse woman or a third generation or a second generation or didn't have a name or didn't have this or that that like this is achievable you can get this i mean you're not going to get it from me <laughs> but you can totally you can you can totally do it and um i i it's cool to know that um some of the girls that come up to me was like hey like you you winning this it is actually it's kind of inspiring to me you know and just that made me feel um amazing 